All right, so I just arrived back in San Diego late last night and everything is pretty much moved out except for most of my stuff. And so I'm spending all of today clearing out this entire room. That means taking out all of this stuff on my wall, my uh, wall of stuff over here, my posters, everything that's in here, this, all this stuff, all this stuff down here. And I'm moving it over to my new place where I'm gonna be living in the fall and taking some of this stuff back home. And then I'm also gonna help them clean up in here because we have to have our inspection done later on this week. It's really early in the morning right now, it's about 6 a.m. and I just went over to Starbucks right now. It's about 6 a.m. right now and I'm gonna start taking this stuff down on the walls. I'm loading up the car right now. This is my second trip. I'm taking stuff over to the new place right now. This is a uh, second load of stuff and then I'm uh, almost finished here, at least taking this stuff out anyways. Um, look, so we've got up here, this is my bed, I already took my bed apart. And then all that stuff I'm taking home, but this is the room now, it's like completely cleared out. So this room is pretty much done, I just have to finish cleaning it a little bit more. But it's just close to being done, a lot of trash here to take out. It is currently 10 p.m. right now, and it has been a very, very long day. I started at 5 a.m. this morning. I woke up at 5, went to Starbucks, and then began working at about 6. So that's about 15 or 16 hours that I've been working today on all of this. And I just finished up uh, doing the Swiffer and the broom on the floor, and I finished up there. That is my room up there. It's completely empty, and I'm about to go home now. So I have to drive all the way back home tonight. It's the end of one chapter of my life and the beginning of a new one, which will be the new place I'm living in for this next school year. Uh, I was just counting it and this is my, I believe this is my fifth home right here. This is my fifth home in under three years. So the next place I'll be moving into will be my sixth place. I believe it's my sixth. Take one more good look at this place. So I'm with, this is Angela's younger sister named Tess, and she does a good, uh, <laughs> she does a good Stewie impression. No, from, a drunk Stewie impression. <laughs> drunk Stewie. <laughs> drunk Stewie. <laughs> she does a good drunk Stewie impression from uh, Family Guy. Take Angela, it away. you have to start it off. You have to say it. <laughs> what is it? Um, Give me your keys. Okay. You can't drive. Give me your keys. You can't drive. No, you have a right to say you're drunk. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> All right. You're drunk Stewie. Give me your keys. Yes, you can. Come on. Is this Ready? from a particular Wait. episode or something? Or yeah. Just... yeah. Oh, okay. Like, okay. okay. Give me your keys, Stewie. You're drunk. You can't drive. <laughs> I can't do it. <laughs> <laughs> All right. What do you say? We'll get okay. it. All right. Here we go. Ready? All right. Uh, this is not a thing. Go. Okay. I swear to God, you guys, I can't do it. Pretend like it's an audition <laughs> test. Nobody's gonna be like, hey, you want to do a drunk Stewie impression? <laughs> What sure, if they're like, what if, you're, what if you're at a job or something, they're like, you know what, Tess, we really think you'd be great for this role, but there's one last thing we need to test, test here. Can you do a good Stewie impression? I got this! Yes. <laughs> I got the, I got the hint of Stewie. I heard that. Okay, Andrew, you start it with the first line, and then you follow it up. Okay. Okay. Ready? Here we go. Fine. You're drunk, Stewie. You can't drive. You're not drunk, Doctor. What? Wait, what? what? I couldn't do it. I'm not feeling this Stewie impression too much. What are you doing? You're drunk. You can't drive. You're drunk. <laughs> <laughs> I can't start it. I can't freaking wear it. Oh my god. So Stewie becomes an alcoholic. Okay. okay and <laughs> Brian goes. Where he goes, give me your keys, you can't drive, Stewie, you're drunk. Like, I'm not drunk. You're drunk, Ryan. <laughs> and he goes, do you think, do you think Lois will like these outs? <laughs> Ryan loves low. <laughs> <laughs> so I can actually, I can see, I can picture this like being an right? actual thing. Right? Yeah. Manwich. 
Oh, it's, gross! It's gonna look gross when too. it's cold. <gasps> That's so gross. It's just like look, sauce. sloppy Joe sauce. Yeah. What is that? Sloppy Joe. That's yeah. Really gross. Okay. Put it on top. Oh, you got it. Yeah. I feel like. Okay. We're here at Target and we're getting uh, some canned food. Tess here is an avid YouTuber and she suggested that we do a. A ch food challenge tonight? Tin can challenge. The tin can challenge? Oh, I have to watch YouTube videos on this. I watched yes. like a bunch of these challenges. But, but I'm, never... I'm a better YouTuber than you, so I'll put that out there. <laughs> we're, we're, we're talking about who this watches more YouTube <laughs> between the two of us. I'm a 16 year old girl who doesn't have a life. Wait, we should, we should see our number of subscribers. I just checked the other day. I have close to 70 people I'm subscribed to. You're what? Why? But I'm committed. Like I, said, I watch every single one of my subscriptions. Yeah, I usually do too. Oh, really? From the first episode, from the first to uh -huh. like the last. And <laughs> I don't have. A We're life arguing over time, who so has who subscribes who to more people. Oakley? We need we need quality cat I'm food here. Quality cat food. food. So, but he's if you guys are gonna make me multiple cat food, food, I want quality cat food. <laughs> so none of this cheap yeah, thirty nine forty cent stuff. We're going for the ten for seven dollar. There's no more though. You guys better not make me be the one to eat this. How? How is that possible? It's, it's completely random. Yeah, it's you completely broke random. Broke your toe. <laughs> you, broke your toe. <laughs> you guys are carrying everything. I'm not carrying anything right now. We've just arrived home. We're at the home of Tess here. And she introduced me to this tin can challenge, which we were just watching Tyler Oakley's video of his tin can challenge. <laughs> so these are our cans right here. And in case you guys do not know what the tin can challenge is, Tess will do the honors of explaining this. We have 10 cans and five of them are bad and five of them are good. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna unwrap all the tin cans so they're gonna be completely naked. And we're gonna put numbers on them and then we put numbers in these little bowls and then we're gonna be grouped up into teams and then we're gonna randomly choose them. And we have to eat a spoonful of them <laughs> and let's hope we don't get cat food. Like, <laughs> yay! I feel like, yeah, this is no definitely the weirdest one here. This is <laughs> This that is like not even I'm intended for humans. Sauerkraut is probably Wait, let's These are the numbers. And we're going to do it a little differently because normally it's just like, you know, you just go back and forth. But since there's going to be four of us, it's myself. Is he taking a shower? No. Oh. That's what I thought too. Oh. I was like, okay. I heard the water running. So it's, it's me, Christian, Tess, and Angela. So we're going to get into teams of two here and kind of go back and forth. So wait, does that mean that we're doing two... Like two spoonfuls, like per turn, because like you know the both each people person. on the team. Yeah, yeah each so. person. That's how we're gonna has do it. One. Yeah. Oh my God, this is <laughs> so we're coming up with team names right now. I'm on team, the team hashtag with, Tevin. Or Tevin, because Tess and Kevin, right? You know? <laughs> I'm not at all. Tevin. Tevin. Apparently, we're team kettle chip. <laughs> <laughs> team kettle chip versus team Tevin. Tevin, the K chip. Don't, don't do that. K don't do that. <laughs> don't do that. What was that? It's a good like. All right, so we're gonna choose. First number, I think you should choose. Oh no. You put feelings all in the video. Five. five. Yeah. All right, number five. Right here. Give me some Fruit. tangerines. Yeah! <laughs> tangerines. Dude, I love some tangerines. <laughs> First of all, they're mandarin oranges. <laughs> video, people know. How is it? Come on, team kettle chip. <laughs> what is Four. it? Sauerkraut. sauerkraut. We need to get sauerkraut. Well, I mean, totally for. I'm like really allergic to sauerkraut. Shut up. Oh, wait, what? You're not. Oh man, look at that sauerkraut. I need to smell it. I need a little whiff. <coughs> oh man. I like how you stabbed your spoon into it. And it didn't really like quite <laughs> sink in, right? You like took a little bit of effort to like actually press into it. Kettle chip. Let's go with kettle not chip. Cat food, oh so. my god, this smells so gross. <laughs> Cheers. Alright, you guys got go. this. I can't. Come on. That is when my camera broke. We were playing the uh, accent game. Angela was um, filming with my camera and she dropped it. I picked it up and then I tried to turn it off. And I got the lens error message. My other Canon cameras that I've had have had that uh, lens error problem. So I'm guessing it's just kind of a problem that they run into when you use cameras a lot. Angela was the last one to be holding my camera when it dropped. So she's automatically assuming that it was her that broke the camera basically. And uh, so I was just giving her a hard time about it yesterday. So I am using my dad's Panasonic Lumix right now. Hopefully it filmed all right. I haven't really quality of it right there. Anyways, I'm heading over to uh, Emmy's house right now because we're going to the Dodger game tonight. She 
somehow got a hold of some tickets. Dodger Stadium here in Los Angeles, California. I can't zoom with this camera. The dirty diaper on the car. <laughs> on the car. On the car. On the car. We're at Dodger Stadium. We just parked. Okay. And we're walking up to the official uh, entrance area. This is the uh, where the cars drive into the parking lot up here. Mm. I don't have zoom on this camera. I realize with my other camera you could zoom while you're recording, but with this one, it doesn't seem it works. It's 90 degrees out here right now. It's five o'clock. Oh, I know. That's right. It's five o'clock, 90 degrees. So it is definitely a scorcher today. Yes. It's definitely a scorcher. So we made it in time then. Oh, nice. All right, they're giving out like some some jerseys or something of that nature today. And we made it in time. They only give it to the first how many people? 40,000. 40,000. Ooh, look at this. 40,000? 40, Did you see 40? That's because I got them already. <laughs> Enjoy. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, thanks so much. All right, look at that. Free jersey today. I just got a free jersey. I believe it's a jersey, right? He just got this for free. Free, my good. friends. Hey, this is Andy's first game right here. First time. Oh, sorry. Stadium is right over here. We're finding our section right now. Look at that. It's a, it's a sign. Hey! Hey, it's a sign. Gangnam style. Look at all these people. Okay. It's pretty good down here. Just been seated. What? Oh, really? Oh, dude, let's come meet up. Four? Whoa, what the? Dude, that's pretty extreme. Four? Section 6RS, uh, row K, seat number six. That's where I am right now. And this is our view right here. We've just been seated. Luckily, we're in the shade. I'm excited for this begin. We're like right in the middle and everything. Emmy's got her fan right here. It even squirts. Let me see. First Dodger dog experience. First Dodger dog in my life. <laughs> nice! Yes! There he goes. Look at this glorious hot dog right here. It's got mac and cheese. It's funny because I was going to eat it for lunch. but And chips on it. Look at that. It's amazing. Mr. Camino bought this for us. That was nothing. <laughs> Wave is coming right now. It's over here right now somewhere. Going to Don't let it die. No. So, are you serious, man? All right, currently we're in uh, we're in Los Angeles right now, driving home from the Dodger game, and there's a special street here. What is it called? Carol, Carol? Carol? Avenue. Carol, like Christmas Carol? Carol, like Steve Carell's wife. Oh, Carell. 
No, like his wife's name is Carol. Oh, like Carol. Christmas Carol. No, it's not. Okay, so we're on. C A R R O L. But I don't think that's going to matter when on video. <laughs> we're on. Oh, we're on Carol Street. Carol. Street. <laughs> if I jumped out and filmed the house, would that get me arrested? No. Okay, I'll That'll do it real quick. That would give you weird looks, if anything. Is that nothing? Like this car here is stalking the neighborhood. Yeah, it's okay. It's like, it's historic. I mean, it I'm is. sure these, neighbor, these neighbors no. understand. Seven. Yeah, hold on. I'm going to get out real quick. What, what? So I'm walking down the street. I just turned on my lights so that you could see. But um, if you guys know the show Charmed, this house right here. I don't know if you can what? see it. Ah, oh, no, you can't even see. It's too dark out here. Anyways, I'm standing in front of the house where they filmed um, the TV show Charmed. That's like apparently the house right there. And this is like a historic street because they uh, film a lot of shows here. It's too dark out here. Oh. <laughs> Mr. Camino wanted to leave you. Oh, really? I did not want to. <laughs> You know what we should do right now? You said we leave. leave. He said it just like that, too. <laughs> nine. nine. <laughs> Hold your breath, bro. She just slowly peel it back for me and say, Oh my god, that was so bad. Are you really gonna do it when I do it? Yeah. Cheers.